morning you guys so I'm currently on the way to my hair appointment I'm changing things up a little bit nothing like too too dramatic but I do want to get like curtain bangs so I'm really excited for that and then I'm probably just gonna get a trim or something not exactly sure even what I'm gonna do yet I booked this on a whim last night at like 11 o'clock p.m. Actually, it wasn't 11 o'clock. It was it was like 9 o'clock. I'm being dramatic, but I booked it on a whim and I just really felt the urge to get my hair done because I haven't gotten it cut for five months now and it's just time for a trim. It's time for a change and my hair just feels like gross. You know when you just haven't cut your hair in a long time and it just makes you feel a little bit gross? Like that's how I'm feeling right now, not to be dramatic or anything. But yeah, so anyways, today I wanted to do like a living my life like a Pinterest board for the day. So basically this is our first thing that we're doing is we're going to get a cutie Pinterest haircut because I did look at Pinterest for the inspo for this haircut. I'll show you guys the photos if I have time because I am running late to this appointment. But I haven't been to the gym in literally two months so it was my first time going to the gym in so long and yeah i'm just gonna do like a perfect pinterest day in the life because i'm a pinterest girly and i love scrolling on pinterest it's like it's definitely my favorite app it just gives me so much like inspiration and so i'm kind of just following my pinterest feed for the day and taking that as inspo on what i'm doing i want to get my nails done but i haven't even don't have an appointment booked so we're gonna try to call the nail appointment while we're driving here in a second I don't even know what I want to do with my nails like I don't know if I want to get a fill or if I want to get them taken off I have no idea what I want to do with them yet like I don't even know what I'm doing with my with anything today it's also last minute but whatever yeah so that's why my hair looks a little weird right now because it's just so greasy too whenever I get a hair appointment I go in with the greasiest hair possible because I'm like, oh, I'm just going to wait until I get a haircut to wash my hair. And then I just put it off and put it off. And it just gets so disgusting. Yeah, I'm so excited. I've just been craving a change with my hair. It's a new season. It's a new me. And I feel like this is just perfect for the Pinterest day in the life. Um, I had to put on an outfit really quick to run out the door. Because I was running so late when I got back from the gym. How was I can help you? Hi, I was wondering if you guys potentially have any appointments available today for a fill. A fill? Sure, give me one second here. So the next little time will be at 4 o'clock today. Okay, that's perfect. We'll see you at 4 o'clock today. Awesome, thank you so much. Okay, you're welcome. Bye now. Okay, bye. Here is how my hair turned out as you can see I got little curtain bangs and I'm so excited like just like having a new kind of haircut really motivates you to I don't know it just makes you feel really refreshed and like rejuvenated and like I feel like a new bitch a little bit you know what I mean yes yeah, so I got cute like little like longer curtain bangs but they're still like layered so they're really nice and then I got just like a two inch trim because my hair was had like two mini split ends and it was getting disgusting so now my hair just feels so rejuvenated and healthy and she said like my scalp is pretty dandruffy and so I bought four scalp products because she told me that you need to take care of your scalp like you do skincare because if you think about it like under all this hair your scalp is skin and it needs to be taken care of and so she said that your scalp needs to be exfoliated needs to be moisturized and not a lot of people take care of their scalp but that is what is gonna like help your hair grow and keep your hair healthy because it all comes out of your scalp and it's like I just realized I'm like damn I never do anything for my scalp like I've never bought one scalp product in my life and so she was like you gotta take start taking better care of your scalp because like she was showing me that it was like flaking and i'm like oh shit like i didn't even know that anyways so i bought four products i'll show you guys right now so first product i bought is this like um scalp treatment you leave this on for four i mean 20 minutes and it's supposed to just like be good for your scalp i don't know exactly what everything does scientifically i forgot like it was a lot of information anyways and then i got this treatment which is a serum that you put on this is like the last final step it's a leave-in serum and then i got this exfoliating scalp that you use to after no before you shampoo yeah before you shampoo you exfoliate your scalp 
to get all the dead skin off and then I got the shampoo which is like a cleansing scalp shampoo so it's supposed to just really cleanse and like open up those follicles that are clogged and yeah because I don't really have a good shampoo that does that at the moment and I've never had one actually so I'm really excited about this line um, they're from Kevin Murphy and she told me that she really likes their scalp products and yeah so it literally says skincare for your hair so I just realized I have to start taking better care of my scalp because she said that if you don't it can learn lead to long-term hair loss and I'm like I don't want that to happen because I'm not taking good care of my scalp and those products will last me like a long long time so it was worth the money I spent like $200 on them altogether but you know what you guys money is energy and at the end of the day it's like <laughs> the more money that you spend and not care about money the more money you're going to manifest into your life like i'm not even kidding you the months i spend the most money are the months i make the most money i don't spend that much money because i'm making more money but it's literally it literally just happens like that because the more i worry about money and the more i care about it that's just like putting so much negative energy towards it and those are the months that i don't make as much money and the months that i just don't give a shit about money i treat life like a video game i'm like who cares if i want to buy this like life is too short what if you die tomorrow it's like you're not gonna buy that thing like money isn't even real you guys honestly i think about this every day it's so funny how people like money is our number one stressor in this world but it's not even something that's real you don't take money with you when you die it no it's the man-made thing anyways so that's just my little money speech of the day it's like don't give a shit about money because at the end of the day it's like yes you need it to survive and you need it to live but there's no point of worrying about it is what i'm trying to say <laughs> So you guys know how I'm basically addicted to online shopping and if you are too then I got your back. I would love to thank Top Cashback for sponsoring today's video. You guys are going to want to hear this so do not skip. Trust me it's going to save you money. So basically it's so easy. Top Cashback gives you money for shopping. They have over 7,000 retailers on their website. You go onto their website, you make an account, it's super easy. It honestly seems too good to be true but it's not. So after you make an account then you can browse their website, you can see all of the stores that um, they have on there you can even search stores and then you just have to click to shop that store and then it'll link you to that page and then once you check out top cashback tracks what you bought whatever the percentage was that the store had originally set on it is the percentage that you're gonna get your money back from that purchase there's no minimum fee of like for like a payout so you can take out your money whenever you want so websites on there like include amazon there's airy there's a whole bunch of clothing websites i'm actually gonna look for you guys right now so i can tell you because there's so much good stuff there's lululemon h&m stock x asos top shop levi levi's is 10 percent cash back that's so good american eagle gary new balance anthropology van forever 21 lulu's sephora so if you're looking for a specific website you can obviously just go on and then like type it in to see if they have it but they have so much so for example if you shop levi's it's 10 percent um cash back so if you spend ten dollars on their website you get a dollar back that adds up like if you spend a hundred dollars that's ten dollars back that's a lot of money that you're getting back that can then go back to you which is insane so you may have heard of like other um, cashback websites before but top cashback is actually the best because they give 100% of your profits to you so that's why their rates are higher than most websites so yeah if you guys go into my description box and click the link that is in there you guys will get a $10 top cashback sign up bonus plus cashback for spending $25 so yeah if you guys want to save money go click the link in my description because trust me it is so worth it and then you can use that money that you get back to go do more online shopping so yeah thank you so much to top cashback for sponsoring this video and i hope you guys go check it out and enjoy it just as much as i do because i cannot help myself so i just changed my top because i was just getting hot and i took a million photos for my instagram story so if you guys don't follow me on instagram you should what are you waiting for i am actually getting really good at posting daily on there on my story I just posted a story and you're missing out if you do not follow me. So go follow me on Instagram. It's just Mikhail Bento. Anyways, so I have a new appointment at four. Got to leave in around under an hour. But I have no idea what I even want to do to my nails. So I'm going to just like scroll on Pinterest and get some inspo because I literally have no freaking idea what I want yet. Probably something more folly and I think I'm going to get a fill. 
because I just don't know if I'm ready to take off my nails. Yeah, I just really need to figure this out because I have no idea. I told her that I was going to get French, but I'm not even oh shit. I'm not even sure if I'm going to get that. I just haven't really found or I haven't come across any cute nail nails lately. And now my whole Pinterest feed is just hair because what I have been like looking at i actually do have a nails folder but i don't know if i have anything good saved in there okay i really like this yellow but i feel like it's just like maybe too similar to what i already have pastel yellow i really like that and but it's not really folly i really like this pink that's really nice so maybe i'll just get those pink because i don't know like i haven't seen anything good lately let me type in fall nail inspo i do like this white too though this is a really nice just like plain option so i think i might just do that actually that's really pretty okay i'm just walking in right now but here are the four of my nails i'm so excited i've had these for literally a few months now so so excited to get them off i think i'm gonna do the white but i'll let you guys know I'm obsessed they look so cute and clean thank you so much to the girl who did them she was so sweet and I gave her my YouTube channel because she saw I was filming but anyways I'm obsessed with them and they're kind of like perfect medium because I didn't know what to get so yeah they're perfect I love them so much they kind of remind me of like the Hailey Bieber um, nails that were trending <laughs> So I just went to the grocery store. I got some groceries because we are going to make a Pinterest recipe. It's this Thai red curry soup or something like that, but it looks so good and I'm so excited. So we're gonna make that when we get home. I just love soup so much in Thai food. So I'm really excited to make this. It's already six o'clock by the way. The time today has just flown by. I don't know how. <laughs> This is how it turned out and it looks so amazing. I will link the recipe for you guys down below if you guys want to make it. But it was honestly so easy and it looks so good. I haven't tasted it yet so I'll let you guys know how it is. But I am so excited to eat this. This looks like the most professional thing I have ever made. It looks so freaking good. <laughs> thing that I'm doing for this Pinterest day in my life is obviously a face mask because this is like so Pinterest to do and it's supposed to leave this on for five to ten minutes so that's what we're gonna do this is just the blue um, nourishing spirulina clay mask but yeah so now I'm just going to set a timer I was literally looking for my phone and before and it was holding up my camera okay i'm gonna set a timer for 10 minutes and then we're gonna wash it off but in the meantime i'm just going to go relax and watch some tv <laughs> so much for watching today's video i am off to bed but do not forget to go check out top cashback everything will be in the description i love you guys so much and thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't love you guys